wave of COVID vaccinations are underway in Arizona, and they started at the Phoenix VA hospital with a World War II veteran getting the first shot in the state. Now, Jason Barry has a story. It was an historic day at the Phoenix VA with 94 year old World War II veteran John Mohun becoming the first in Arizona to get a COVID-19 vaccine. Well, they, they needed some volunteers and, and you guys have been keeping me alive, so why shouldn't I try it? Huh? I would have died if I didn't come in here. The country's here because of us. Yes, sir. I'm proud to be a World War II veteran. The World War II vet got his shot along with a dozen other health care providers around 11.30 Tuesday morning. The Phoenix VA was one of the first of 37 VA sites around the country to receive a shipment of the Pfizer vaccine, with early doses going to frontline health care workers and veterans living in long-term care units. So many people have put literally their lives on the line, right, to care for these folks. Uh, and this is a way for us to begin to do something, some very real things beyond what we've done to bring about hopefully the beginning of the end for this pandemic. But while the Phoenix VA is now using its vaccines, other health care providers in Maricopa County are waiting until Thursday to start giving shots. So why the wait? As long as we do it right, who cares? You know? Dr. Ross Goldberg is president of the Arizona Medical Association. He says the logistics of setting up drive through vaccine sites, organizing appointments for patients, and protecting the vaccine itself, which must be stored at extremely cold temperatures, requires a couple days of extra planning. Yes, this isn't a race. We're all trying to make sure that we're safe and we're good getting it. So I'm okay waiting a couple extra days if it means that we have much better information and a much better system in place so it goes smoothly for everyone. What you don't want is things to fall apart because of free-for-all. All right, and more than 384,000 doses of the vaccine are expected to arrive in Arizona by the end of December. Now let's go out to Dominique with the latest local numbers.